Hey guys, it's Tinker Taylor here today, bringing you the final video for this series. Uh, now, last time when I was telling you guys about the last video, I accidentally said that was the final one. I did correct myself straight away, um, but I realized I was trying to say that we were on like the final stretch um, because I'd finished this build by the time I recorded that video. And so it was a little confusing in my brain because... Um, and been doing a lot recently, a lot of uni, a lot of um, building, a lot of behind the scenes secret planning stuff. Um, so it's been a little bit stressful. Um, but yeah, we're, we're currently 25 days, I think it is, away from finishing. I say we, me, I am currently 25 days away from finishing. Um, so I'm very, very excited about that, finishing uni. Uh, but then I have, yeah, got the secret project that I'm really excited to work on. It's going to take a very long time. Um, probably three to four years. Definitely three for sure. There's no, no doubt about that. Um, it potentially four years, depending on certain factors. Um, and I was thinking about whether or not I should announce it in this video, um, because... I don't know, it's getting closer and closer to when the project is going to happen, which is next year. Um, but I don't know if I want to. I don't, I don't know if I want to. I'm very um, unsure, but I don't know. I've, okay, I don't think I'm going to. Um, mostly because I haven't actually started on any of the builds yet, uh, but... I am very, still very excited for it, and yeah, as soon as uni is finished, we're going to jump into first A to Z challenge builds, and then these builds, so we're going to go and figure out the schedule for that, because it's going to be a little bit, oh, I don't even know if I can, because my A to Z streams take me all the way to the end of the year, I think. Let me check. Yeah, see, I'm I'm taking the week... Of Christmas off and New Year's those two weeks um not necessarily from building and, and video editing and all that but I don't know what I'll be doing then um I don't know if I'll have any plans if I'll have any um yeah any anything that I want to do so we're definitely going to see how that goes um but yeah, definitely the first stream back will be... When will that be? Actually, that's fine. The first stream back being not the start of the project because I kind of have to work on other things during that time. Um, so yeah, it'll be like part of the way through the project. Like 5% of the way through. Look, like I said, it's going to take me years. Um, and... I'm only like 25-ish percent of the way through the planning. Uh, I ended up changing where I kept it, so now I don't actually know what percentage of the way through I am because I just don't have that stuff. Oh, okay. I'm not going to be able to do it there. All right, you know what? I'll figure it out later. Um, but last time I checked, I was at like 20 percent but I reckon I'm probably at 30 percent now um maybe I don't know I, I I've made some decent progress on it um I've still got a long way a long long way to go uh, I've mentioned this in previous videos it's over a thousand builds that I'm planning on doing um so sorry I've never realized how loud my mouse click is because I I have this thing on my mic where I can listen to myself and I'm just listening to how loud that click is in my left ear but also my right ear in real life and yeah that that's pretty loud I'm sorry um but yeah it's it's a very interesting project I feel like some people are going to severely disagree with what I've done um and a lot of people are going to be like wow that's kind of kind of silly the way you did it uh but I'm not too mad about that. I don't, I don't really 
mind being, I don't want to say true to myself, that's not the right word, but just building the way I want to. Um, but I'm also a thousand percent open to new ideas, especially since I'm not completed the planning of this project. I also started planning a save file last night. I had an idea of doing like a, a, a collab save file and I was like, wow, wouldn't it be really cool if I could do this sort of idea and invite these people and, and you know, open it up to everybody else and, and oh, it'd be really fun and cool. And um, yeah, no, it just ended up turning into my planning my own sort of save file. Very, very um, broad brief planning, um, you know, a lot of the builds that I'm planning are just called traditional house. And when I say traditional, it's just traditional to the world that it's in. So if it's in Sulani, it's going to be um, like an island home. But if it's in Brightchester, Brindle Brindleton Bay, um, I think it's Cape Cod and Hampton style. I mean, that sort of style, I think it's going there. Um, and then in Willow Creek, I believe that's like a New Orleans vibe. I'm not positive. This is all based off things that I've heard a while ago. Um, and I am definitely going to try and lean into that. But that, that, I have no idea when that's going to happen. Because like I said, this project's going to take me a very long time. Um, I'm just hoping to get it done well. I've also limited myself, so for this secret challenge, secret challenge, secret project, that's the word, um, I have decided that only a certain amount of them are allowed to be 40 by 50 or higher. If it's got 50 or higher in it, I can only do it for certain ones. So apologies if you just heard my cat, um, she's being very, very attention-y this morning. She's not normally this attention-y, so I'm definitely paying attention to her, playing with her, giving her love and attention. Um, and I think it's because it's raining and she can't go outside. She loves to go outside, uh, and she can't because it's raining and she doesn't like the rain. So, yeah, she's just, I don't know, a little, a little annoyed at that. It makes me sad because I love rain days. I really do. Um, She's currently sitting behind me, so I can't even move my chair back because I don't know where she is. Um, there she is. I'm just reaching my hand back trying to find her. There you are. What are you doing? You okay? And she's got like a scratching post in here. It's not actually a scratching post. It's a storage cube with fabric on it, and it's turned into her scratching post, but it's the only piece of furniture she really does scratch other than her actual scratching post. So, you know, that's a cheap storage cube. I'm not too mad if she rips it up all that much. Um, because it means she's not destroying other furniture. She's never, like, scratched at the bed. She tries the couch a little bit, but we stop her straight away. Uh, but anyway, this build is nearly done. Um, I want it to feel very luxury, very dark, very, um... Kind of like the apartment I did in, well, this same same world was it Ciudad Enamorada, the penthouse build I did. Um, that was the vibe I was going for for this. So definitely let me know if I did it right or if you think I could have done it better. Um, because I'm always, I'm always open to feedback. I love getting feedback. Um, but yeah. I also did, again, keep it very minimally furnished intentionally to make sure that we didn't overwhelm and clutter the game up. Um, but that is pretty much it for this build, so definitely let me know your thoughts and opinions on it. Um, the next build is going to be a collab build or a shell challenge. I haven't decided which one's going to go up yet, depends on what I feel like. Um, they're both nearly finished, which is really good for me um because that's a lot of content but then i have to work on this really big city build that's on a similar size lot to this um but yeah anyway until the next one i will see you guys then bye